Gwen Stefani and Blake Shelton both saw the undoing of their respective marriages in 2015. In July of that year, Shelton announced his divorce from fellow country star Miranda Lambert after being married for four years, as TMZ reported. This is not the future we envisioned and it is with heavy hearts that we move forward separately, they said in a joint statement. Stefani then filed for divorce from Bush lead singer Gavin Rossdale that August, ending their 13-year marriage, per TMZ. The No Doubt singer had joined The Voice the previous year, when she filled in for Christina Aguilera, as The Hollywood Reporter noted, so she and Shelton were already acquainted. Amid those difficult months, Stefani and Shelton developed a bond as they navigated similar situations. Next thing I know, I wake up and she's all I care about, and I'm wondering if she feels the same about me, Shelton told Billboard in 2016. By November 2015, they were openly a couple. Blake and Gwen have begun dating. They've been supporting each other through a difficult time and they're really happy together, a source told People. They made their first official appearance as a couple in February 2016, when they attended a Vanity Fair after-party following the Oscars, as People noted. They acted like giddy teenagers at a high school dance, an insider told the outlet. Shelton proposed to Stefani in October 2020, news he shared on Twitter and she on Instagram. Just months after their July wedding, however, Shelton is already admitting he's a deadbeat husband. Blake Shelton joked about how he didn't help plan the wedding. Blake Shelton and Gwen Stefani tied the knot on July 3 in an intimate ceremony on his ranch in Oklahoma, Page Six reported. Their guests celebrated the marriage under a large, white tent decorated with flowers, the report detailed. Unfortunately, Shelton had nothing to do with any of it. At one point, I was saying in an interview, we're letting Gwen do whatever she wants for the wedding. And then some writer wrote, well, oh, look, he's already a lazy deadbeat husband. But the truth is, I am, Shelton joked on the Ellen DeGeneres show on December 3. Shelton said he simply trusted Stefani's vision better. What do I know about any of that stuff? He said. That's not to say he didn't enjoy the festivities. All I had to do was drink and kiss Gwen Stefani, I mean, my God. The greatest gig I've ever had, he added. Shelton previously addressed his lack of wedding planning skills, showing he was concerned about ruining the party. If I was picking our meal, it would just literally be everything fried. I think she knows that it would be a pretty classless wedding if I was in control, he told USA Today. However, Shelton and Stefani said their idols in the chapel Shelton built especially for the occasion, per page 6, so he should give himself at least some
Shelton and Stefani said their idols in the chapel Shelton built especially for the occasion, per page 6, so he should give himself at least some credit.